Hi, Dio neighbors. Rado Goji here. And I'm Sorl and Greg. And welcome back to more of Let's Play uh, Randomized Link's Awakening. Yes. And um, when we last left off, we were fucking stuck, as <laughs> usual. <laughs> but um, I did have the that aforementioned epiphany. Yes. So. Um, so we've had a fun time here on... <laughs> Let's play Randomized Link's Awakening, where every entrance and entrance, every exit and entrance is completely scrambled up. So, if I may direct your attention, squ just squint your eyes for a bit. I'm squinting my eyes. <laughs> well, you don't have to, but um, you may notice that um, we're missing the power bracelet, and there's a lot of things that the power bracelet's locking off. Yes. And the uh, rocks are there to a lesser extent. Yeah, having to, like, walk all around is annoying. So, because of that, uh, progress has run head first into a wall yes uh, but since we last uh since we last played i did have a couple of ideas that might be able to come, uh, move us forward with this oh, all right so first off uh we have this thing i've marked with a sword this was marked with a power bracelet this is the entrance to the color dungeon okay uh at first i thought in order to be able to push the the, the uh the gravestone properly you needed the power bracelet right um but uh, after a while i found out that that wasn't the case I see. So we may be able to go through that, and that might take us, you know, to some place we really need to go because we haven't we haven't even found level four and six yet. I, I realize. No, we have not. We're missing two dungeons. Yep. And the other idea I I actually came across this while looking up notes on the randomizer itself. Uh, this little um, entrance I've marked with the uh, flying rooster. I see that. That's, yes. that's, Direct your attention, please, to the flying rooster now. That's the cave where the bird key normally is, and in the vanilla game, you do need the flying rooster to get through. However, to prevent soft locks, uh, this was a, the room was actually changed a little bit, so that you only need the hook shot to get through there, oh. which we have. Oh. So hopefully, I'll be able to find maybe the power bracelet in there. Um, the power breaks is like the main thing that I hope that we yeah. find of anything because yeah. even once that's once we have that we've got half the game map and even and, and, and even even then we could probably get through a lot of the rest of it um, by using the uh, flying rooster as a stopgap for the rock's feather. Yes. Um, and then we can and even if we get one of those two things we can start actually clearing dungeons. Yes, that would be wonderful because so basically. We get one of these things going to break the whole game wide open. So I'm going to head over to the um, color dungeon entrance that's right. because that's... we've got a. I don't have that. We've got these things on pegs on a board tied together um, oh, lots of with string, string uh, uh, and they all lead to uh, a big question mark, a big YouTube logo in the middle with a question mark underneath of it. And it's uh, I think you know it's a little bit early to say, but I think that the um, I think the the mastermind behind it all is going to end up being PewDiePie. PewDiePie. Yes, yes. PewDiePie created this bastard seed. <laughs> to, to, to try to make up for the fact that he lost, like, to number one yes. subscriber spot. Yes, that's still going on. He, that is, battle still rages. And he's uh, there. taking Those it out on uh, Brave like me. internet. Yeah, I mean, because <laughs> if, if you were the, the largest content creator on YouTube... I mean, well, you would obviously find someone who who gets like a half a dozen regular viewers and just fuck with them. <laughs> yes, you would uh, you would splice Momo into their videos. I don't know what Momo is. I'm oh my god, now. you're so lucky! <laughs> I, I got an email about Momo from my kid's school district. It's this new creepy pasta thing that has become like a huge urban legend oh, about like making kids like hurt themselves or something. And it's got this, like, creepy image of this, way. like... I, I gotta look into it and find out what it is. It looks like something from an SCP. It's like a right, how do I get back lady with, like, big eyes and, like, a like a slit mouth. She's freaky looking. Oh. Um, just trying to figure out... It's all fake. It's all internet one, bullshit. Uh, once again, how to get it back over here. Oh, of course. Uh... Of course! I know it seems like, oh, we're just sitting here, like, looking at the map. This is so boring. I'm going to unsubscribe. I'm going to leave an angry comment. You're not even going to see this because I'm this part's go, being cut out. <laughs> I'm going to go over to PewDiePie. But you know what? This is difficult. Like, imagine... Don't cut this part out. Imagine if all of your entrances and exits were randomized. You walk into your bathroom. Bam! You're walking into work. 
Oh, no. <laughs> you. You. But I have to pee. <laughs> you go out the front door work, bam, you're in Walmart. <laughs> I have to pee. I can't take a call right now. That sounds like a dan That sounds like an SCP, actually, like a randomizer for. Okay, I know where to go. Okay, sorry. Sorry, I just had to look around, see where things connected to, and how I could get around this freaking force field that is um, blocking basically these two halves of the map here. Yes, yes, we have a big problem with large rocks. Uh, um, Link and rocks don't get along. The, the very west side of the map is is completely isolated from, like, the central and eastern parts. Uh, so I have to... Well, you know to... what they say about the East End boys and West End girls. Uh, no, I don't. <laughs> but, um... Uh, that means that I have to, like, go through all these different pathways and, and entrances and whatnot and remember where to go so that I can get from... Get, basically go five feet. And that's the, um... <laughs> That's that's uh, that's what's wrong with the world today. That's absolutely that's that's chaos. You know, this is definitely like an e this is this whole seed is like <laughs> definitely like an Ian Malcolm. Like <laughs> yeah. your scientists were so preoccupied with whether they could, they never <laughs> stopped to ask. What should we make a Link's Awakening mod where all the entrances and exits are randomized? Well, the, um, the Zelda 1 randomizer was like that, too. And, you know, to be honest, that was only, like, one of the options. I could have I could have opted to not have that happen, but I'm just so used to doing that, and it's so much more interesting to me that way. Because this is still fun. Yeah, but, I'm, um, I'm finding... Oh, sorry, go ahead. I guess it just makes it that much more um, satisfying... Yeah. When you find a solution. I'm definitely finding that the Link to the Past randomizer has has increased my interest in, in Link to the Past quite a bit. Yeah, which is the other LP that we're doing. Yes. Uh, we're also going to be, we're just up for at least a while. We're just going to do like the two LPs and not the you know, podcast and yeah. stuff like that. It's, uh, yeah, it requires a lot of work and editing and... It's just the... Uh, Those things are bad. It, well, this still requires work and editing, just not nearly as much. And yeah. Like, anything that I have to record with a video camera, um, like, it's usually... I don't know. I don't even know... Because usually when we do a podcast, it can last anywhere between oh, a yeah, half hour to an hour. Oh, yeah, it's completely random. Yeah. It's not like we have notes, like, down to the minute or anything, like a professional production, where it's like, oh, this is how long the podcast will be. And we have, I have to, I have to watch, like, the entire thing to know when to, you know, make cuts and, uh, and stuff like that, if it necessary. It doesn't help that I keep randomly screaming racial slurs. Uh, I know Patrick um, does a really good job editing those out, along with, like, the, oh, all the no. death threats I make, and... And um, the random like five minute rants about uh, about uh, overpopulation and what what's the problem? It's not letting me in. <laughs> it's that meme with uh. I could have sworn you don't need. Let me in! Let me in! I could have sworn you don't need the freaking power bracelet to to open this. Uh, it just says you you look at the grave and the grave is blank. With this creepy, this is the most creepy pasta moment of the entire run so far, because Son it's. Of a bitch. Son of a bitch. It's, uh, you're in a graveyard, you push the graves, and you're looking at a grave with this creepy music playing, and it's just blank. It, and what, what would you do if, like, one time it just said, I don't even know what it would say. It would just say something horrifying. Kill your family. Kill your family. <laughs> the bendy man commands it. Okay, well, that would kind of ruin the whole, yeah. the whole creepy moment. Um... It would just be like a, I don't know, the, 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 the most scary thing I can think of is like an Ebenezer Scrooge moment when you say, oh, it's my name on the grave. Oh, yeah, that would be good, actually, if it, if it, like, your real name, like, on the grave, I would freak out. I'd be like, how'd you program that in, Patrick? And I'm like, I didn't program this at all. Patrick Jackson Stoddard. That's not, That's not his real <laughs> name, I just made that up. Um... <laughs> And me, Greg Methuselah Bond. <laughs> Gregory Maximilian Starling. Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig. <laughs> All right, I think it was in here. Nope. Nope, that's it not was it. the other one. That's just a... That's, that's actually where the cave is under normal circumstances. That's a watering hole. But yeah, we can go up in here.
No, 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 it's all going wrong again. Uh, no, it's coming apart. No. Mommy, the dog is sharp again. No, you no, got it. No, you got, I got it. it. I got it. Okay. Yeah, you got it. I'm about to say, I need the rock's feather. And then I realize I can just, like, hook shot across Oh, boy. This that, was, that was... <laughs> That's, that was That was scary. You almost had me for a second. So, yeah, this this whole... This is normally just all a pit, and these boulders aren't normally here. Ah. Do ah. the Charles Nelson Riley over here. What? Can you get through that? Yeah. Ha! Okay. Please, please, for the love of God, be the power bracelet. If this isn't the power bracelet or the rock's feather, we are fucked, and I don't think we can finish this. You no, got me! You're fucking kidding me! <laughs> Didn't you want money? <laughs> <laughs> Who could it be now? <laughs> wah, 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 wah. Who could it be now? Wah, 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 wah. This is, you should just play a loop of that, and it's like, please stand by. <laughs> like like, like a dog, like a... a dog, like, pulling, like, an old lady's, <laughs> like, ice cream cone bring or something. Up, bring up, like, the technical difficulties. Oh, yeah. With the, with the Dragon Quest. Theme. Exactly. So, wait, what the fuck is it, then? That's the, 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 the bitch. That was, like, my last hope there. That was the last hope. What I was supposed to be able to get in here, and I was supposed to be able- This is sick, this is this, No! This is a fuck! This is a fuck! What- what? What in the world? Jesus tap dancing Christ on a pogo stick! What the fuck do am I, am I supposed to do? You know what, Patrick? What? You just got beat! <laughs> 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 It's 1073 the big <laughs> What's in the what's in the room to the left? Is there anything in there? No, it's just basically a way to say, oh you can go over here and then you can go up there, but you're blocked off. Can you sneak up there somehow? Oh no, there's 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 nothing to get. There's um even if I do go well, I mean that now I'm gonna be blocked out here. But, oh, okay. Um, it just basically goes into the same room where the treasure chest was, but just in a way that you can't get the treasure chest. Have you checked under Link's bed? Link does not have a bed here. What happens if you go down the waterfall? Um... Didn't we get a key for another dungeon a while back? Yeah, we got the bird key, but we can't go in there without the power bracelet. Because we need the power bracelet to access the keyhole. If I go down here, I'll probably soft lock. No, no, it won't, because we have the flippers. I don't know, man. What's up there? I don't. I don't even. I'm just like going a direction now. Um, I really, I really thought that was gonna be it, man. I thought that was the. I'm really. That was the the thing. That was. That's like every possible thing I can fucking do. I'm not even kidding. This is. This is. And you're sure we can't? It, it's. Is is it possible that it's it's a not beatable seed? It's possible. It is possible. I didn't even know that was a thing. I'm fairly sure though that when they generate these, like uh, it said that it was okay to do because it'll 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 do a certain amount of tries. But it's to... okay to do it. It's not going to hurt you. I mean, the logic will, will go through Maybe. like um, will basically go go through and play the game without showing the game or whatever. And when and when, if it goes through twenty times and can't find a solution, it'll tell you it's, it's possible that you can't beat this. Folks, the remainder of this LP will be replaced with for the frog the bell tolls. Um, um, I really, I, I know this map far less gooder than you, sir. So, well, what I can always do, load up a different seed and see where we go from there. Uh, I mean, that's a possibility. Are you, are you, we officially throwing in the towel? I don't know, man. I, I, I can't see any possible conceivable thing that can help me right now. Uh, we've done everything in every dungeon that we can access without the stuff, without the stuff that's needed to go further. Mm -hmm. Every single entrance is a cave that's blocking off a, a chest. Or something, and we need either the rock's feather, the Pegasus boots, or the uh, power bracelet in order to access them. And any other place that we haven't been on the map yet, 
we it's either blocked off because of the walrus. We need to actually do like some uh, activate a story thing to do that, mm-hmm. or we need Pegasus boots, power bracelet, or, or rock's feather to access it. Quick question: I'm just looking at the the map here, and I'm looking at the icons and everything. Okay. Um, did we ever? Is there something keeping you from from putting the powder in that that little demon dude? No, but we don't have the, we ha- we already have the upgrades uh, uh, capacity upgrades for the uh, magic powder and the bombs, but we don't have the bow yet. Okay, so he just gives you a capacity upgrade. He doesn't give you like a random item or anything. No, all okay, the capacity upgrades mind. are the same. Never mind. Well, we could always. Do the Dark Souls randomizer. Just kidding. I'm not, not, not going to do Dark Souls. Let me have but... Dark Souls. Yeah. Not on Linux, we don't. Mm-mm. Like, how long did it take? How long did it take us to get to this point? Like 17 minutes. 17 minutes. And uh, we're already at a point where we we're just kind of flailing around. We're pretty much just like, I, I I I can't see anything to do. There's there's nothing. What do? Unless like, well, we made a mistake somewhere, but it's which possible. I, I freely admit is possible. It's entirely possible. Um, uh, I could. I mean, I can access the. Uh, I can. I was, I was thinking I could. I could access the um, pothole field and go get the slime key, but I don't have a shovel to dig it up. Right. Is there nothing we might have missed, like in the beach area? I feel like that's like the one area that we've gone to, like a very limited amount there's a chest i i I don't know if it was a chest or um uh if it was if it was replaced with a piece of heart we already got it but uh there's a chest there that i need the power bracelet to access okay and um um, the two openings that are there we already went in and and, and they were either something useless like a phone booth or we did everything we can do in them okay um even but yeah, even even considering dungeons, the ones that we can access, as as far as I know, we've gotten everything that we can out of them without um, the items that we need. Right. So complete. I I was I was absolutely convinced that one of those two things was going to help. Was going to be like the rock's feather or the the it, cause, because power it, bracelet or, or no? I mean, if the I could, Pegasus boots. I mean, well, at least going up in the uh, no, it was it was not necessarily that, but. The um the graveyard the uh, the color dungeon I was I was certain I could open that and um and it's not letting me in and that's probably blocking us off to a dungeon or something where we could access more chests that or like a chest that has a fucking thing we need right this is bullshit this is absolute bullshit everyone betray us I fed up with this world I fed up with this seed. I fed up with this seed too. Let's. St- I'm gonna start a new seed. Okay. And um. Yeah, I know. I, I like emailed them like a shit ton of these myself. So I, right. I have another. I have another seed that we can do. Awesome. So um, we are officially throwing in the towel, uh, intrepid viewers. Failure. Failure. Ooh, ooh, ooh. this run got beaked. <laughs> <laughs> so, the beak. Ooh, 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 ooh. So I'm I need going to come up to... with like a. Jingle on uh, on in Garage Band to like. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm I'm gonna start the next scene. I'm going to, I'm going to uh, start the uh, the title numbering over again. So it's gonna be like four dash whatever instead of three dash whatever. Yeah. And I'm just gonna label this as three dash final. And I'm gonna see if I can keep going with the Judas Priest theme naming. Sounds if good. If I can, but uh, uh, until then, I've been Ray Goji. and I'm Soylent Greg, and we'll be here next time. Join us, won't you?